Hi, it's me, Ben. Ben, how do you know we got an update not too long ago? We are here to check out the Gazelle Collection. Now, if you buy this from the market, it will come with the Gazelle Shoulder Guards, Gazelle Chest Plate, Gazelle Leg Plate, Gazelle Machete, Gazelle Skin, and a Gen. If you don't own the Gazelle Gen Skin, rather, and the Gen himself. So if you don't own a gin already, you get a gin. If you already own a gin, you get another gin. You can delete it or have a free mod slot or whatever you want. Now this is my current gin. Now I'm going to put the new skin on him. Oh, I actually like that. But just for the purposes of stuff, let's see what it looks like at default color. Actually, I kind of like it default. Now, it's not bad at all default. Actually, let me see something. Default colors. Yeah, I think I could rock that. Huh. Okay. Well, anyway, in addition to that, the collection also has a gazelle machete. Now, let's read the description. Each kill with this swooping blade adds bonus damage to the gen sentinels next Fatal Attraction ability. In turn, Fatal Attraction bestows the weapon with a period of corrosive damage. So, this weapon seems to go hand in hand with the gen. Now, what stats? These are the basic stats for the weapon. Um, you know. So it looks like 39 slash puncher, you know, low puncher, I mean, but even lower impact slash is its main thing. It is 25% status, so it is a status weapon, which actually makes perfect sense if you think about it. And let's see if I want to copy Wolfram colors. If I want, you can change the color to whatever you want. I'm actually just going to hit default for now because reasons. Anyway, you definitely for the gen want to, yeah, that. And then when it said fatal attraction, what it means is this. This is the gen's fatal attraction. And hey, you can actually use the gen now because you have universal vacuum. Vacuum on all the sentinel. So you can definitely have fun with the gen, use fatal attraction, use all that stuff. Now, what type of weapon is this thing? That eh, doesn't really matter right now. Anyway, so you can use all that, but that's not all. Let me actually go to, uh, for now, I'll stick to this. I was just checking something, honestly. What we're going to do is, for now, not the Mag Prime armor. Okay, we'll go to a different preset. You guys convinced me. For now, we got to change from the Mag Prime armor because the this gazelle, gazelle set stuff for the shoulders. For the legs, the right leg, 
the, the left leg. To get this white, we might want to Wait, is there one for the chest? Let's check. Yes, there's one for the chest as well. But to get this correct, we might not want her to be as shiny. So, this is just to show off. Actually, you know what would be best to show off this? A fearsome appearance, Operator. If we just made everything black, right? Well, yeah, just make everything black, right? And now we can show off the thing. Okay, there we go. The gen color scheme stuff, of course, you can have it match the main colors if you want, so it becomes all black too, but you don't want that. Well, I don't want that anyway. You customize it however you want. And I think they look pretty cool, honestly, but that's just me. I think they look cool. So, yeah, now, we looked in the market and we kind of saw the price, but let's go check the price one last time, and then we will be able to fully see the complete collection. You can buy it for 255 Platinum. Includes a bunch, includes fashion frame set, of course. Now see, this is where you see it on its um, best it can be thing. It looks pretty cool like that. I think it does, anyway. I just don't use Excalibur a lot, but I am going to be using the Gen sometimes now, believe it or not. So yeah, I'm gonna end the video here guys. Hope you enjoyed that. Later.